everyone and welcome back to my channel Ina Rabino de Hilig. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe and of course click our notification bell for more updates on our newest videos. This time, what you're gonna watch is a different kind of episode because this is the first time we're gonna be doing a product review, like a food product review. And so, let me get it for you because yeah, unbox pa natin. And then, yeah, food tasting. So, so it just arrived. I had to put some notes because my kids uh, might open this up and I told them I still have to review it unbox and open it and then make a review and record it for my episode so good thing that my papa ate wala nagbukas wala nag attempt even though yung bunso it was really forcing me like okay no vlogging sabi sa akin sabi ko no they sent it for free because we will review it so so at the shop and of course it arrived safe and sound i just want to check anong uh kalagayan niya sa loob and by the way, I just had my dinner. I just had my dinner. And um well, sila di ako na rin na kumain muna kasi ayoko yung sasabihin nila na parang baka kaya maganda yung review or baka kaya ko sasabihin masarap kasi gutom ako. Kaya kumbaga I have no choice. So, kumain muna ako and then syempre, mahilig kasi ako parang may dessert afterwards after eating. So, eto, eto na yung the best na na dessert siguro na matitikman ko kasi yun nga, I'm sweet tooth ako so yun yung isang bagay na hindi ko maialis sa akin even though I'm trying to lose weight paulit-ulit na lang ako nagsasabi na I'm trying to lose weight nag-lose naman ako ng so far 8 pounds na po yung nalulose ko because I gained 20 pounds so um, naging 120 ako during the lockdown and then 112 na ako ngayon so o ba may progress din naman kahit hindi pa nakaka-exercise talaga Kanina yung dinner ko is just sinigang na salmon head. Uh, so, nilagyan ko na maraming gulay. So, yun yung kinain ko. And, ang ganda rin kasi, ang kinain ko is maasim. Kasi sinigang nga. <laughs> so, para lang ba mas maabsorb ko yung difference. Kung baga, mas madidistinguish natin yung difference ng, kasi this is supposed to be a dessert. So, sweet siya. And then, so, para mas madistinguish ko yung lasa. Kasi kung kumain ako something na matamis ngayon, ba yung during my dinner, tapos kakain ulit ako ng matamis, baka magtalo yung lasa. Siyempre, eh, baka ma... So, I don't know kung after 2 hours pa yata na da digest yung pagkain sa chan. I don't know. Pag nakapasok ako sa chan ko, malalaman ko. But, parang yun. Parang ganun siya. Uh, I don't know kung mas mabilis ma-digest ang mga gulay kesa sa mga meat or other foods but or fats, ba? So, but anyway, excited ako. <laughs> Kasi nga, kailangan fresh siya. So, um, okay. Um, Acknowledge ko muna, of course, ang nagpadala sa atin ito for review is Miss Marilu D. Santos of LA. And, um, gumagawa kasi siya. Well, well she has a full-time job sa, I think, sa LA County. And then, she does this on the side. And this is called uh, Pasti um, Yema and Pasti Ube. So, it's pastillas na yema and pastillas na ube. So, ang nakalagay doon is parang toasted. So, I, pag sinabi mong toasted, I'm thinking of um, medyo crunchy somehow or syempre hindi ganun ka-soft uh, kasi nga toasted, ba? And then, ah, pero naalala ko yung pastillas especially, ang pinakamasarap ko natik na pastillas is the one na dinala ng mother-in-law ko from the Philippines. So, parang sa Manila niya na binili, yung mga, alam mo yung mga pasalubong, something, ganan. Pero parang sa Laguna, ginawa. Either bula ka na Laguna, parang ganon. So, but anyway, yun yung the best na pastillas na natikman ko. So, I'm thinking of a similar kind, pero syempre may twist na ito because it is flavored, no? Hindi na siya yung plain na pastillas lang. And curious ako because when I saw the picture on Facebook, Sabi ko, talagang parang bite size lang siya. And of course, kasi favorite ko yung mga yema, something with milk, and something with ube. So, nung nakita ko na pastillas de, uh, pastili, um, pasti, pa, pa, ba yan? 
pastillas na yema and pastillas na ube. So she calls it pasta ube and pasta yema. So we expect two different um, packaging here because she sent me two packs. So one pack of the pasta ube and one pack of pasta yema. So and and by the way, her store's name is um, Marilyn's Kitchen. Ayon. So ipakita ko sa inyo yung ano contact uh, information like in Marilyn's Kitchen um, sa Facebook. Hanapin nyo lang yung Marilyn Di Santos so you can inquire and then they ship. Ayon. By the way, they ship. So I think it's eight dollars to ship. Um, the item. So, ang maganda doon, wala siyang minimum order kasi she will ship it and on, yan, parang ganito, priority mail and it's $8. So, ang gagawin nyo, might as well buy uh, more than two, di ba? Para hindi sayang yung shipping. So, and the pack only costs um, $6. So, let's go. So, go. Try natin open siya. Okay. So, talagang tiniis ko kasi kanina, Dumating siya na magsushoot ako sa labas for another episode. Tiniis ko talaga hindi tikman or buksan kasi yun nga, kailangan ko muna kasi siya i-unbox and i-show sa inyo ano yung magiging reaction at review natin. Okay. So, ganito pala yung pag-pack niya. By the way, <laughs> etong suot ko na necklace pala is uh, by Aphrodite Jewelry and brand ambassador po tayo ng Aphrodite Jewelry. So, I think you gotta go to their website and check um, check out Aphrodite Jewelry and you can also go to their Instagram and um, what's this? Uh, you have to type INA2020 to get 15% discount. So, it's INA2020 to get 15% discount. Okie dokie. And by the way, my um, acknowledge ko lang, ko lang din yung friend ko who gave me this uh, cute sundress. Like, it's a summer dress, sundress. Although, it's um, not summer anymore, pero ang lakas maka fresh. So, yeah, fresh fresh on ang lola nyo. And then, um, yeah, feel na feel ko yung pagka fresh ngayon. Kasi, yun nga, nadala ko nang na carried away ako nitong uh, sundress na ito. This was given to me by my friend Nelly Kagitla Perez, yung kababayan ko from Ibaan, Batanga. So, mommy Nelly, eto, finally nasuot ko rin um, sa sa episode, ang Sandra sa bigay mo sa akin, this is from Nelly Kagitla Perez. So, thank you so much, Mami. Ayan. And then, so, ato na. Ang laman pala ng loob neto is another, ano pa, pack. So, nakalagay pa rin sa isang ganito. Ayan. Okay? So, para para lang ma-secure because, I don't know, I don't know kung ano nga itsura sa loob. Let me... Teka. Ano ba natin bubuksan? Ayoko kasi masira yung ano. Mamaya magupit ko yung packaging niya. Ayoko namang masira. Hold on. Ito. Hindi nyo pala nakikita. Well, anyway, kinat ko lang naman. So, kinat ko lang siya. Tara! Ooh! <laughs> wow! Ayan. Maraming maraming salamat po ulit sa... Oh, adiba. We can't wait to review on YouTube. Sabi niyo, oh my gosh! So, ayan. Talagang let's pray. So, help me. So, help me God. So, eto. Order receipt. So, normally siguro kung it's uh, parang yung regular na nag-order. So, you have this receipt. You will receive a receipt like this. And, yun nga. Sabi nila... Yeah, so Marilyn's Kitchen, and then nakalagay, we can't wait your review on YouTube. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Napatulungan niyo ako. Ala, kailangan na ng powers natin ito. Ano magiging reaction ko? So, ayan na. Wow, super cute naman. I appreciate. Actually, ang, nung nakita ko to sa Facebook, ang unang nakakatch ng attention ko is the packaging. I really appreciate na yung packaging niya is similar to, alam mo yung may mga salted egg something na mga, kunyari, fish with salted egg. Yung ganito rin yung pouch. Although, green yung kanila. This, is, this one is just brown. Pero, na-appreciate ko. It's very, very cute. And, alam mo na parang uh, what's inside is gonna be special. Yun yung tingin ko, ha. So, kaya sa packaging pa lang, Pag yun nga, may mga food business kayo, or mga something like this, mga desserts or sweets. 
sa packaging pa lang, kailangan binibigyan din ng effort kasi yun yung nagbibigay ng impression. Okay, so ang impression ko na nakita ko to is really something special. Parang mamahalin siya. But guys, this is just six dollars okay and then meron pounds at all like uh, i forgot how many pounds but then titingnan natin kung ilan ang laam laman sa loob but super cute la i can wait to open <laughs> so this one so yan made with love kasi nga naman uh, she does this on the side and talagang purely parang sarili niyang concept yung paggawa ng pastillas na yema so this one is pas pastillema and the, oh my god Ang favorite ko na. This is my favorite. Ano, um, syempre, mahilig nga ako sa something with milk, no? Tapos, sino maha pa ng ube? Yung favorite ko talaga. Everything purple. So, ito yung paste ube. Isa-save ko to. I mean, uh, save the best for last, di ba? So, unahin ko tong paste yema. Oh, gosh. Eh, yema, favorite ko rin. And I do uh, yema balls. Ayan, I still do them. So, ayan, ano ba nakalagay? Food allergy alert. Product contains milk and eggs. So, lalo naman akong allergy sa milk and eggs. Those are my favorite, you know, stuff. And then, so, ito namang uh, pasti ube. It says, food allergy alert. Product contains dairy milk. Ayan, yun lang. So, I'm okay with milk. So, ayan, kung... Oh, so cute. Oh. So I can't wait to open it up. Okay, let me just open, open sesame. <laughs> and so, ang galing oh, kasi you can reseal it. Kanya hindi mo maubos, then you can reseal. So brang ano wise yon na packaging. Kasi, syempre you don't want too much sugar, de ba? So kung hindi mo maubos, Eddie, eh, ang tag natin dito. So seal mo ulit, de ba? Ayan na! Let me see. Ata, ta, ta. Ah! Sobrang tight, ah! Yeah. Oh! Okay. There we go. Let me see. Oops, oops. Ayan. Ayan ang laman niya. It contains um, several pieces. I just don't know how many. Let me see. Ayan. So, ito siya. Sorry. Parang eggnog, yung itsura. But this, I think, is bigger than eggnog. Or, ano ba yung isa? Parang pasensya, yung ganun. Basta it looks like an eggnog to me. So, try na natin siya. Nakalitot brush pa naman ako. <laughs> uh, may iba yung lasa. But anyway. Pastillas nga. Oh, parang may feeling siya. May yema nga sa gitna. Mm. Habang kinakagat mo siya, pas <laughs> pasarap siya ng pasarap kasi may feeling na yema. So basically, yung unang bite ko, I really tasted the inter-traditional, sorry, ha? <laughs> Ay, you're sure na? Inter-traditional na pastillas. So, akala ko nga nung una, sabi ko, asan yung yema? So, in the middle, oh, you, you get something like the yema. So, nag -e envelope na siya, nag nagsasama na sila. Ayun, masarap, good, good siya. So, it's not too sweet. Uh, Ma-appreciate mo na nilagay niyang as a feeling, yung, yung yema. And it's bite, hmm, sarap. And it's bite size. Hmm? <laughs> Lumagay yung... Lipstick ko sa nails ko. So, um, yun na kagandahan nun. I think you can put this in the fridge para sugar to magal. And then, you can reseal it. Kasi syempre, you don't wanna consume too much sugar. So, ayan siya. Hmm? Good job, Miss Mary Lou. Pero, <laughs> sorry. Mmm, <laughs> over up. Like a typical um, pastillas. Well, alam mo yung parang mabubulunan ka because it's pure milk, you know? And, um, is that again? Milk and eggs. Dapat may katabi kayong water. Water, ha? Wag soda or wag juice. Kasi nga, matamis na to. So, but it's not too sweet. Na-appreciate ko na 
there's a feeling, a yema feeling, and so masarap siya, good siya. So I think for six dollars, and marami siyang laman sa loob. I just don't know how many, pero ikakal natin yan, and then uh, ilalagay ko na lang sa screen kung ilan because I still have to count it. Um, so pag naedit ko na siya, so ilagay ko kung ilan yung uh, but but they go by ano eh, by weight. Uh, wala lang naka-indicate dito and I forgot how, how much. Pero I'll count how many. So more or less may idea ka like how many para lang ba when you buy it, may idea ka kung yung $6 mo ba um, worth it ba ng ano. Pero I'm telling you there's a lot in here and it's worth the price. It's worth the price kasi um, masarap siya. Okay? So and it's so fresh. Okay. So good job Miss Meryl's Kitchen. Oh may isa pa. Let me get the other one. Okay, so here we go with our pasti ube. Napapakanta ako because if the first one is really palatable, I think that I will also enjoy this pasti ube. Pastilya sa ube. I, I never um, realized that you could actually make something like this. Kasi alam mo, mahirap gumawa ng pastillas. <laughs> so, yeah, di ba? mishandle mo eh, masisira agad yun, magmumolds agad yun. Or kaya magda-dry and it would get, alam mo yung parang luma ang itsura. So, eto na, eto na, eto na. Ah! <laughs> so, yan na, yan na. So, I'm so excited kasi mga favorite stocks ko to. Kumbaga, comfort zone. Ayan na. So, buksan natin. At ang ganda, talagang sobrang sealed siya. Mm? Nala! Ayan, oh. Can you see it? Ayan, ayan pala. Baka malaglag kasi, eh. Ayan, oh. Can you see it? Parang little, tiny, tiny purple stuff in here. Ang cute. So, this is smaller. It's smaller than, um, the pasta yema. Well, let's try it now. Mmm! Oh, parang may feeling ba to? Hold on, ha? Mmm! <laughs> may ubi sa side. Mmm! <laughs> meron, meron, hmm. Sorry, kaya hindi ako makapag, um, salita. Every bite that I get, na, nadadala ako sa, alam mo sa Lipa, Bat Batangas, uh, they used to have um, yung bus stop sa my um, close to um, which ah ano ba to? Yung bus stop which is almost across Robinson's Gallery and Lipa. Eh, Robinson's Lipa, Robinson's Gallery, Robinson's Lipa. So yung mga ano nang pasalubong yung merong ube pastillas parang ganon yung iba-iba yung color may langka may uh, makapuno ganyan ganun ang lasa niya na masarap so ang ha gong pagkat yun yung may ube mm. good job This is the traditional taste of the pastillas. And, um, nagkaroon ng kanting twist. And, um, maliliit lang siya. So, I think, okay pa rin siya for, for the price. Kasi marami siya eh. And, na-appreciate ko na hindi siya lumayo sa so ina-expect kong lasa. This is what I was expecting. To, to, un uh, uh, unless na lang na parang meron ka talagang kakaibang you know, um, modification. Pero this is um, the traditional taste of a pastillas and uh, I appreciate na hindi mo inaleyo. Kasi yung iba, alam mo, makagawa lang, maki-innovate lang. Tapos, ang lasa na parang ang layo na or hindi na yun yung in-expect mo. So, thank you so much to Marilyn's Kitchen. Let me grab the other one again. I enjoyed... <laughs> And I will still continue to enjoy since hindi ko nga siya na ubos. So thank you so much, Meryl's Kitchen, for sharing your wonderful creation, your pasti ube and pasti yema. I, I am giving you um, 10 out of 10. Okay, good job and thank you so much. So 
kung nagustuhan yung episode today, ayan, and kung gusto nyo mag uh, product review pa tayo and food review, just leave us a comment on the comment section down below. And yes, yeah, so, isa na namang nakaka-enjoy na episode ng ginawa natin. Everything about food, na-enjoy ako niyan. Promise. So, life is sweet. So, just don't forget to take a bite because life is sweet. So, just always pray, be positive, enjoy life to the fullest, and always pray. God bless everyone. Bye!